passed me a note answering my crucial question because he knows as a Privy Councillor what happens next and it is the acclamation. Well, lots of things happen next, Alistair, and there's been a, a, an Operation London Bridge, which has been called, which sets out what will happen in the next 10 days, a 10 days plan, which has very carefully uh, been uh, calculated, including Prince Charles, or King Charles now, uh, going around the country, uh, making different visits. Uh, the first thing that will happen, or very early, will be... I'm going to interrupt, because that's crucial. Yes. Because I, 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 having looked at it before, and, and uh, the, 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 the Bibles, the Operation Tay Bridge and, and London Bridge and, 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 uh, and so on and so forth, one bit I hadn't realised as, as a keen amateur student of, of history is in this united kingdom of ours, it has to be Belfast and Cardiff and Edinburgh as well as London. Yes, indeed. And, and obviously uh, that's something which Charles will now uh, follow through according to the plan that's been devised. One of the earliest actions that will take place is a meeting of the... Privy Council, all Privy Councillors will be invited, I shall be invited no doubt and will be attending that and uh, that's when uh, Prince Charles is acclaimed as the new monarch. Uh, to set him on his way, as it were. Is it from that little balcony at St James's? Yes, we get invited to, to St James's Palace. Yeah. And, and St James's itself, I think it was you in our conversation earlier, as we look at those remarkable pictures, these were uh, from the Trooping the Colour, uh, as indeed were those, but the one immediately before that was uh, the Queen stand, the late Queen standing on her own on the balcony uh, of Buckingham Palace with uh, uh, the, the Duke of Kent. Uh, Duke of Kent, that just... Just look at that picture. I said it earlier and I'll say it again. Mother, grandmother, great-grandmother. As a recent granddad myself, those eyes just say it all. Yes. As that we won to the right uh, will one day succeed her in that line of succession of the House of Windsor. But in that picture, that's my great-grandson. And the little one on the right is saying, and that's Nana. Granny, Lilibet. That is just, Norman, a wonderful picture. Yes, and, and let's remember that, um, as we mentioned earlier on, Alistair, this is a, a loss for a family member. Yeah. And whatever family you're in, when you lose someone who's been uh, key to your family, it's, it's uh, felt heartfelt. And, of course, it's an issue for the public at large and for the Constitution and for the country, but it's also an issue for those who are closely related to the Queen uh, and who will therefore have suffered a a serious loss today in their own family. So let's think about that.